After we've created the main stock inventory, products from other sales channels need to be mapped against the master stock item. Each product has a unique stock keeping unit or variant SKU, and if you use the same across all sales channels, the mapping process will be automatic. Those products that don't match will appear in the product mapping screen. The number in brackets indicates the amount of products that need to be mapped. First off we select a sales channel to view. All installed channels are displayed in this drop down. Select the one you want to map. The default view shows unmapped items with no match. On the left we have a photo, SKU and listing title for all products from the listing on the channel. On the right we show the product it links to in the master inventory. As there is no matched item we are provided with a search box. Using your product knowledge enter a search term to try and identify the individual product. I'm looking to match an extra large t-shirt. Should the top item have been extra large, click map me to link the product in the system. As none of the potential matches are correct, you may want to try a different text search. But if you are confident you can't find the exact product, click on import. If you believe you have already imported this product, you can hit rematch. Our software will automatically attempt to rematch the listing. The stock drop down can filter to show only in stock products. This is particularly useful if you have a large inventory to map, as you may choose to map only the in stock items. The mapped status toggles between mapped and unmapped products. Correctly mapped products look like this and have the option to unmap at the end. And finally the match type shows new listings, all listings, hidden or clones pending. On the right we have an action button. If you refresh the page you would have to reselect the sales channel. By selecting refresh current view this can be avoided. By selecting refetch all listings a synchronization menu provides a powerful list of actions which will be covered on a separate guide. When live your system will check daily for any new listings you have created directly and displays any requiring mapping here. Should you wish to perform this during your system build a manual check can be initiated using this button. These multi check boxes allow you to select one or more items for further bulk actions. The bulk actions button allows you to map, import, rematch or hide all selected. The replaced images button will take the image imported with the product from the listing and overwrite the previously stored image in the master inventory. The view button allows you to specify how many products per page are displayed. The default is 100.